and Mr. Freddy. A sweet day. I love y'all. That was my precious little five and a half pound Mr. Furley. For those of you who didn't already know that, and there's not very many of you that did not know that. Uh, the reason I want to do this quick video is because of a dog named Bella. Um, Bella is a German Shepherd. I think she's nine years old. And Bella's owner passed away about three weeks ago. And in Bella's owner's will, she put in there that she would like to have Bella euthanized and buried with her so that they could always be together. This has caused a big controversy. Animal rights uh, activists are saying that this is unnatural. Some people are saying, well, uh, animals are euthanized every day for no good reason, simply because they're not wanted, and that this is not that big of a deal. Uh, there's a lawyer involved. The lawyer is saying that um, it was in her will that the dog be euthanized and buried with her, and that animals are property, and that the dog is merely a part of her estate. So it could be that the dog will have to be euthanized. What do you think? I think that's just an odd request. Some of the comments I was reading in the comments section say, would she have been willing to have the thing done if Bella had died first? Which, you know, that's, that's just kind of bizarre. But uh, she, she claims that... Uh, the dog needs to be euthanized because the dog don't want to be around anybody else. That she doesn't really trust the dog around anybody else. That it might cause bodily harm to somebody else. Even though my Mr. Furley is only five pounds, I don't trust him around people. Mr. Furley, I love him dearly. But about the only people that he likes are me and my kids. Mr. Furley... I wouldn't trust him around anybody. You know, he might get along great with him. Probably would. You know, 90% chance he probably would get along great with him after he got to know him. But before then, I don't trust him around anybody. I don't trust that he won't bite them. You know, if somebody comes up to me and says, does he bite? I have to say, you know, I don't know. Because I don't know. But I would not ever think of having him euthanized and buried with me. He still have his, has his life to live out. This dog has her life to live out. I think that perhaps somebody should take care of the dog until the dog dies and then the dog be cremated and placed with its owner. Connie, Connie Lay or Connie Day is the name. They have now started a fund called the Save Bella Campaign. Uh, would you be willing to sign a petition? There's a place that you can go online to sign a petition to save the dog's life. Uh, do you think that's even necessary? And do you think the animals are strictly property and should be done with what the woman wants? That is going to be interesting in court because I have heard so many times the animals are merely property. And until next time, bye-bye.